the concept of associated auras, which is a metaphysical theory that certain people have an innate sight or can sort of alter their sense of sight to see the associated energies around a person as a sort of representation of their being, like um, some say it's almost like a, a, an emerging of colours shrouding the person's um, silhouette, whereas others say it's sort of um, a semblance of an animal, sort of a spirit animal representation, or you know there's a sort of motif image, something similar to the person's personality exuding around them, and it's almost like uh, this sort of um, like avatar for them on the lesser plane. Like it is, it is basically the the viewable depiction of their soul energy, their spirit, and it's a really interesting. I will, don't know if it classifies as paranormal, um, as a paranormal concept, but I'm gonna, for the sake of just sense, classify it as one because. It's beyond normal sight. People don't usually see that with normal eyes. So it's something that's really um, intrigued me. And it's hard to verify accounts of people saying it because what someone else sees, you can't see. And of course you want to believe people if the story sounds just and right, but you can't believe everything you hear. And it's almost like one of those topics that's that's so hard to weed through the the lies and and the uh true semblances of it i've had i like i can't see the essences around every person i see but there have been some odd experiences where i've looked at someone and sort of in a quick glance thought i've seen something reminiscent of what I have, you know, thought it would look like, and I'm not saying that that is that, it might have just been, you know, tricks of light, my eyes doing a, a wee woo or whatever, like, but because I posit this as considerably possible, they sort of not justify my belief, but further my inquisitiveness on the topic because I feel like I've come within me personally close to, to the concept that I want to have a confirmable experience either within myself seeing it which would be the most preferred option I'd love to see it myself or have a completely verifiable confirmable source tell me someone who I could I don't know how I would but how I could know with full certainty what they're saying is absolute truth and wouldn't be a lie for whatever reason because it's definitely within my belief system something plausible it's definitely um logical to have even it just being lesser light uh within wavelengths that the human eye can't sense if it's nothing actually spiritual it could just be a really weird light phenomena that people with slightly more in tuned ocular nerves are seeing rather than something metaphysical. But it just sounds really cool. And that's why I'm so intrigued by it because it's like adding this whole deeper level to, to, to observing people. If you could see this, this um, shrouding around them and potentially what it says about them because if you're seeing someone represented as someone as something then that tells you a lot about how you view them and how you're taking them as you know a, a being and also potentially how you could observe these auras interact with you know the surroundings the things around the person interacting with the lesser sort of um Energies. Energies is the only word I really know what to use because I have no clue what to describe it as and because everything is in some way, shape or form an energy. That's my fallback term. So if you have any weird experiences, even if you think they might have just been nothing and your eyes just playing tricks on you or whatever, let me know because it's really intriguing to sort of posit even the most, you know, uh, 
probably not into it could have been 